Hi there guys, this is just going to be a very short video. I've just picked up my last barn find, so now I have them all. It was this, uh, oh, do excuse me, I just banged the mic. Um, it was the uh, GT40 uh, Ford, and this is the complete collection. So, if you don't have any of these, and you want to see what it is that you're missing, what you can look forward to, these are all of the barn finds. I've got to say, probably my favourite is the GT40, Mark 1, 1964 Ford. I did have the other GT40, the Mark 2, the Le Mans one. Uh, when I first picked this up, uh, I expected it to be the same car, but it isn't, so that's pretty good. I also love the Elise. Uh, I like the Exige and the Elise. I'm a big fan of Lotus, uh, Lotus cars. So, there we go. Um, that is the collection of barn finds. I'm guessing by now most people will have all of these. I've not driven this yet. I used to have a little go in that. I used to have a Mini. It wasn't a Cooper, but I've had a Mini. I've had several Minis. Anyway, let's pop over to the map. And for those people that don't yet have the barn finds and don't want to go looking around in the big circle, I'll show you exactly where they are. So let's turn off everything apart from the barn finds. This should be in alphabetical order. It really should. So, this is where they are. So, we're going to start up here. Uh, let me zoom in a little bit more. Gives you a nice idea of exact locations as opposed to looking around and around, which is what you normally have to do. Well, they are quite easy to find, but it did take me forever to find one, and that's the only one I actually videoed. So, there you go. If it tells you what they are, no, just barn find. Didn't think it would. What was the one that took me forever to find? It was this one, wasn't it? Uh, this one over here, I think. Yeah, it was that one. I'd already seen it, and then when it came up, I just could not find it. And it's crazy because I'd seen it before, and I did want to mark it on the map, but I didn't do that. So, I hope somebody finds this video useful. I'm guessing that most people will have already got all of these and uh, have a complete collection just like I have but if you haven't and you are looking for a barn find they're not that hard to find really are they but now you know what they are and you know where they are so there we go guys barn finds uh, let's get back can I look at them from here I can't can I have to actually be inside my castle I like this castle. I prefer this one to the Edinburgh one, to be honest. It's more castle-y. So yeah, I quite like it. So yeah, there they all are. Some things of beauty. There wasn't anything interesting at all in the GT40 uh, Ford. I think the only one that had anything worthwhile in it was the Spitfire and the MGB uh, GT. Uh, this car has 300,000 credits, this car has 200,000 credits, and you can buy them quite cheap on the auction house. Usually people haven't taken the credits, but they sell for about 14,000 anyway. So, I mean, you could buy, you know, like 20 of them, even more than that. And if even one of them has the credits inside, then you've got a, a really healthy profit. So, there we go. Those are the barn finds. I had a friend who had one of these, and he loved it. His first car, a red Escort RS Turbo. And it was exactly that model as well. So yeah, he loved it. That was 1990, and that was his first car after he passed his test. I don't know anybody who's had one of these, but they are beautiful. What else have we got? I do know someone who had a, uh, an Audi Quattro. It was red. It was like this one. It didn't have body kits or anything like that. It was pretty much standard. But yeah, he loved that car. Don't think I know, I know a few people have had Range Rovers, but who doesn't? Do you know a person that's got an E-Type Jag, lives quite close to me? It looks just like this one, it has the wide wheels and it's red. And I've had loads and loads of minis. But aside of that, I don't actually know anyone who owns a Subaru, which is pretty incredible. I know someone who loves them, I'm not that keen. But there we go, that's a little rundown of the barn finds. So I was hoping for something a little bit more special than what we've got in here. I was very disappointed with the Range Rover. Uh, I've never, I've not driven it. Uh, the rest of them I like. I like the P50. I know a lot of people don't, but it's kind of special. I love those little cars. 
So there we go guys, there's the barn finds and you've seen the locations. If you don't have them all yet, then I hope this video has been useful for you. If you do have them, then obviously you won't have watched this. So, take care, see you soon, bye bye.